guys and welcome to my kitchen so today i'll be preparing something special something out of the regular so please don't go anywhere watch to the end to find out what it is so we had this overripe plantain the way they got ripe over and i made us regret buying it hobby was like we should just start frying it so that it was not waste and i was like don't panic i got you <laughs> i know i bought something like plantain more and more online so i decided to try the experiment we bought of unripe plantain to mix with the ripe so we can make it so i'll be making plantain more and more let's do this first i had all the plantains peeled and cut into small sizes just as you have here in the video next i'll be blending it into a smooth paste i'll repeat this process until they are all blended so these are the ingredients i'll be using these are simple ingredients just like what you use for the regular beans moi moi. i have pepper onion seasoning cube crayfish dried fish and palm oil so i'll be blending the crayfish the onion and pepper and i'll mix them with the already prepared paste i had mix them thoroughly i prefer bl blending my seasoning cube with the ingredients when making moi moi or sometimes i use warm water to dissolve it so it does not go in as a lump and someone gets to chew it it will be disastrous so next i've added my dry fish like you've seen and i went with a little bit of water to loosen the paste a little because plantain has a fluffy nature when blended i started to mix thoroughly and then i went in with palm oil and gave it a good mix i gave it a thorough mix to ensure that the oil does not flow just as you have seen here i i turned and mixed it very 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 well until it's all mixed with the plantain paste and then we had this wonderful face here i seen the mixture very beautiful so i added salt to taste and then gave it a good mix i checked to see if the salt was perfect and yeah it was i tested and the taste was okay so for this i'll be using plantain moi moi so these leaves are already washed and allowed to strain off the water. You know it's a mess whenever you are making any pudding with these leaves. First, I will cut off these sticks and add them to the leaves. I'll be using as a base to prevent my plantain moin moin from burning. And then lay the already wrapped moin moin in the pot whenever I'm done. So if you want to learn how to use leaves for moin moin, this is how to go about it. So I'll be doing one so you will see either one or two. In this video so you get to see how to wrap plantain moi moi first is to make sure that the leaves are free from holes then place a small or moderate size on a big one go down towards the tail and fold towards the left and ensure that the tail is properly closed then you wrap to the right and then tighten it ensuring the bottom which is the tail of the leaf is sealed then you can bend it upwards and hold it with your hands just as you can see and then you can go in with your pudding which is your um, plantain or moin moin paste that is it you open where and pour in your moin moin now this is how to close it seal and move the leaves to the left and then to the right just as you have seen in the video hold closely and bend down facing backward and then place it on your parts let's go again first you tighten the edge or which is the tail to the left to the right rather to the left rather and then turn back to the right hold it firmly and make sure that the, the tail is properly sealed to avoid it pouring out and fold backward spread out your leaves make sure it's properly opened and then pour in your plantain or moin moin paste into it exactly just as you can see here in this video to seal it you have to go to your right again to your left and then fold it backward and ensure it's properly covered and place it on your pots you will repeat this process until you have finished packing them all and go in with a little water the water should be moderate because it is steam that prepares foods like moi moi not water but you'll be checking occasionally to see if there's still water and if you need to top up cover and allow to boil for 40 minutes i covered mine with the leaves in order to trap the steam in order for the moi moi to boil or get ready early enough so i'll come back later to check when it's ready or occasionally to see if i can still add a little water so 40 minutes later our plantain moi moi is ready 
and so i have to check it so guys remember this is my first trial of plantain my, my, i'm the one that convinced Oga to allow me do this so hey if this is no sweet name you say go use mouth finish me today so let's try it out so i opened and guess what i checked so if you want to know if your plantain your plantain moment or moment is ready just dip your spoon or fork into it and when you dip it in if it does not stick if it comes out smoothly then you know it's ready as you can see our plantain moment came out very 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 nice and beautiful so let me test this let me do the first test and wow it's very hot but i'll try homo ah it's a heat thank you so much for watching bye